following announcement has been paid for by the Jackass. What's up, nation? It's your boy, ETCW, World Heavyweight Champion. Yo, the world, Craig. Shit, not just the city, the world. The Jersey Jackass, prize of the Rabbit Empire, an enforcer to the Finstock Exchange. B to the C, hit me up on all social media at RealJackassBC, R-E-A-L-J-A-C-K-A-S-S-B-C. Back again with another movie review. This one comes to us from New Movie Monday, and we got scooby dooby doo where are you? I'm ready and... What are the words? I, I only know the scooby dooby doo part. Give me that soul! Buckle up. Hello, adventure. Yes, will you take my name and number off your list? Scoob. So, Scoob is a brand new animated feature. I mean, animated, CGI, whatever. Detailing a new adventure in Scooby-Doo. It's going to show us a little bit of how they uh, got the group got together. It's going to go on out. And it is meant to set up a greater Hanna-Barbera uh, cinematic universe. Okay, good things and bad things about this. Uh, I didn't love it, but I thought it was okay, and it definitely had its moments, and it definitely had some cute times, and uh, de there were a lot, a few laugh-out-loud moments. First off, the cast, for the most part, is all really good. So, Scoob stars, legendary Scooby-Doo voice actor Frank Welker, Will Forte, Mark Wahlberg, Jason Isaacs, Gina Rodriguez, Amanda Seyfried, Kersey Clemens, Ken Jeong, Tracy Morgan, and even Simon Cowell as Simon Cowell. So this movie was a little bit of fun. I enjoyed it. I had a good time with it, but I felt like they tried to do too much. Hmm, Warner Brothers trying to do too much for cinematic universe. Sounds familiar. I kind of actually feel like these movies should have been split into two separate universes. Scooby-Doo is great. I love seeing Scoob on there. I love the gang when they're together. That's a lot of fun. But I prefer movies where Scooby-Doo is doing just what Scooby does. Does They find somebody, pull them out. It was Farmer Jed the whole time. And this kind of puts them more into a real superhero world where there is actual fantastical elements like the Blue Falcon. And so that's where I kind of have a problem with it because there's an actual bad guy and it's not like a dude in a mask or a ghost or something. And with Scooby-Doo, I prefer that. And they split the crew up uh, for the good majority of the movie. Shaggy and Scoob are off with Blue Falcon and his crew. And then Fred, Daphne, and Velma are off trying to catch up to them and help them. And there's a cliched storyline between Scooby and Shaggy and it's just, it's something that we've seen a million times, even in these Scooby-Doo movies. But I actually really enjoyed the chemistry between Fred, Daphne, and Velma when it was just them doing things. I really enjoyed it. I would have wished they had more of them along with Scoob and Shaggy together. Standout of this is actually Mark Wahlberg as Blue Falcon and Dino Mutt, Ken Jeong. They are so much fun. Now they're where their movies should be completely separate. We should have had something with the Blue Falcon setting up its own Hanna-Barbera world. You could have Blue Falcon, you could have Birdman, Captain Caveman, and even Space Ghost. Wouldn't it be so dope to have a Space Ghost movie? Hell yes. The villain as Dick Dastardly is actually really kind of cool. It's kind of see that little tie-in. Again, Hanna-Barbera. I, I think he would have worked better in a little bit of a Hanna-Barbera world, not Scooby-Doo. And I understand that Scooby-Doo and Blue Falcon have been together numerous times, but still, to me, it just... I wish they would have separated this. Now, the biggest issue with me is Will Forte as Shaggy. God awful. Every time he spoke, it took me out of it. Because that's not Shaggy. Casey Kasem is Shaggy. Matthew Lillard is Shaggy. Will Forte, you're not Shaggy. Sorry, it was awful. All right, score time. We're giving Scoob 2.9 out of 5. But wait, Jeebus bonus. Another point two for Mark Wahlberg and Muttley. <laughs> That gives us a Jeeva score of 3.1 out of 5. What about you guys? Have you seen Scooby-Doo? Or Scoob? Did you like it? Does Shaggy's voice bother you as much as me? Would you like to see a Space Ghost movie? Do you want to see more of these Hanna-Barbera films? Whatever you're thinking, comment down below. Hit this little subscribe button. Click the bell to get notifications on all of our videos. Give this one a thumbs up and share it with all your friends. Follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok, because my TikTok is fire, at RealJackassBC, R-E-A-L-J-A-C-K-A-S-S-B-C. -S -S and join the Jackass Nation Patreon at patreon.com slash jackassnation. And until next time, Scooby-Dooby-Doo, I still don't know.
The words that are in this damn song. The preceding announcement has been paid for by the Jackass Nation.